ado, may I invite Her Royal Highness, the Princess Royal, to view the letters patent and uh, open the veil. Well, first of all, thank you very much indeed for your, ladies and gentlemen, for your invitation to join you today um, at this very historic occasion to uh, these letters patent. This is the proof, um, in case you didn't have already thought of that, uh, of becoming a city. Congratulations. Uh, it's always a pleasure to come here. And I know I'll meet a few more of the groups uh, that are represented here. But all of you have contributed to this uh, award of city status. Uh, everybody who comes here probably has the same sort of welcome, as I know I did in 2013 and in 2016. And I know that the Aurora Aquatic and, um, and Leisure Complex, which I opened, have proved an enormous success. And it wasn't as if you were, at that stage, thinking you were going to become a city. That was just a very good investment, which has proved to be a, a, a very successful one. And of course you mentioned uh, the sea, naval traditions. The last time was the 150th anniversary of the Royal Ulster Yacht Club. And that's an interesting history of its own, but very much linked to the history of Bangor itself. I suspect a lot of people have learned a little bit more about Bangor's rich heritage than even the locals already knew. Very nice to see you. And I suspect you've lived through the whole of this process. <laughs> this a, and it, I have to say, instantly, they also showed you the, the forms that you had to go through. So I've actually got a pretty good idea of just how, how much that is.